Now that you're familiar with the display of the HMI, let's dig a little deeper into the function of it. If on or off is not present on your HMI, or if an override button is present, this typically indicates that scheduling is enabled, and the unit can enter an occupied or unoccupied state depending on the scheduling settings and occupancy timing. Pressing the override button also manually forces the unit into an opposing occupancy state temporarily for 60 minutes. During the occupied times, the unit can accurately target optimal space conditions regardless of varying space heat loads. While unoccupied, the temperature set points can be set more conservatively to sacrifice space temperatures, some while shifting the focus to energy savings. We suggest unoccupied setbacks of no more than 2 to 3 degrees. If on or off is displayed on your HMI, the unit does not have scheduling configured and will need to be manually enabled or disabled by pressing on or off. After the on button has been pressed, off will now be displayed indicating the unit has been enabled and may now be shut down by pressing off at any time. The climate control state idle should change to blower and eventually to heat or cool depending on current set points and space conditions. It is important to remember that pressing the off button will shut the unit down abruptly, which can be harmful to various mechanical components. Off should only be pressed when the unit is in an idle state, at the end of a shift or in the event of an emergency. Pressing the temp plus or temp minus button will override the current temperature set points and move both the heating and cooling set points respectively for a short period of time. The default temperature override maximum is plus or minus five degrees for 60 minutes. The temperature offsets and override timer can both be modified in the factory configuration by tech support if necessary. It is important to note that temperature overrides can be restricted by discharge limits, which are also covered later. So don't be alarmed if you can temporarily decrease the temperature set points by 5 degrees, but only increase them by 2 degrees. Contact tech support if a temperature override is required frequently. This indicates the heating and cooling set points need to be fine-tuned further for the application, and we'd be happy to help with this.